How's it going? My name is Wonderbro Jake, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get your Steam key for Adventure Quest 3D. Now, firstly, you're going to need Steam. Now, I'll put the link in the description for the official Steam um, webpage. Um, or you can just go to Google, type Steam, and then the first one, Welcome to Steam. Click that, that will load. Now, firstly, you want to make yourself a login. Get a login, join Steam. And then fill out this. So you got a Steam account name, um, your passwords, your email, and the caption to make sure you're not a computer doing it. So now you'll be here. Now you just want to agree. Make sure you're um, 13 or older. Just click I agree if you are, and then create yourself an account. Once you got all that sorted, now you want to install Steam. Click on Install Steam now. Then a prompt will come up, steamsetup.exe. All you want to do, click it. Now, a prompt will come up saying, uh, do you want to allow this app to make changes to your PC? You want to click yes. I'm going to click no. Um, I didn't know if you could see that. You might, um, My capture might not record it. But just click yes on it, and then it's going to download some files for Steam. So once you have Steam and you've logged in, you'll have something like this, but obviously you'll have no games as it is a new account. So to get your Steam, um, Adventure Quest Steam key, you want to go to an account. Make sure you're logged into Adventure Quest 3D. Now you want to come down to here and click get your Steam um, key. You want to highlight that, copy that, and then you want to go to Steam. Now you want to go to add games. Now you want to go to add rate produce on Steam. Um, click yes. Click I agree. Now copy and paste the Steam key. Now it's saying I already have the game installed, blah blah blah. But just for the sake, it'll say blah blah blah, and it'll say congratulations, you got the game. Now click next. Now you are about to install Adventure Quest 3D. Now, there's two options you can have by here, create a start menu shortcut and a desktop shortcut. Uh, start menu, I do believe, is when you click that button, it'll come up and the desktop will be on your desktop. Um, top. Now, all you want to do is click next, and Steam has queued Adventure Quest 3D for download. So, once you've done that, all you want to do is to go to downloads, and then I don't know, there we go, it's going to come up. I already downloaded it, but you know, it's going to say, um, download required stuff like that all you want to do is click on this arrow button to put it forward and then it's going to start download um, it's only 1.3 megabytes so it's not that much but make sure you got no one using the internet as it might lag them out depends on your internet speed now once you have all that installed you are ready to go so once you have it installed go to Adventure Quest 3D it should be in this if it's empty it'll be the only one there or just look for the A if you already have games installed. Now all you want to do is I'll close this actually. Close my game. Click this play button. Yeah, I'm just going to prepare to launch. And now you all you want to do is just put your password and your um, email and password. Click yes. Uh, put your password for Adventure Quest 3D. Click play. Click on the server. There we go. I'm in game. Um, I haven't played the web version um, version of this game, so um, I don't know if you have these settings, but um, I don't think you do. But again, if it's if your resolution is a bit cramped or the game isn't fitting um, well, you know you can have a mess around in here. I haven't got mine on full screen because I'm recording, and you know if your PC is not the best, you can turn down the quality. But this isn't really that intensive game so and I don't really think it makes a difference not really I can't see any difference well anyway guys um, that's been how to download and get your steam key and steam so um, yeah guys if you enjoy like comment subscribe and I'll see you in the next one